This video is showing a statue of a fallen angel found by miners in a uranium mine in Siberia, Russia. The miners said that there was something strange about this statue because it had hot air, even though the temperature around it was very cold. When this statue was found, it was in perfect condition and there was no damage at all. Many people believe this is not just an ordinary statue, but a real angel who has fallen to earth because it looks so alive. Even experts believe that with current technology, it is very difficult to make such a perfect statue. Let's discuss from the book of Revelation about fallen angels and their connection with the drying up of the Euphrates River in Iraq. The book of Revelation is the final book of the New Testament and contains a vivid and symbolic description of the end times. In Revelation, fallen angels are referred to as demons or unclean spirits, and they play an important role in the unfolding of apocalyptic events. These fallen angels, led by Satan, are described as spiritual beings who rebelled against God and were cast out of heaven. Revelation chapter 12 verses 7 to 9 describe this heavenly battle. And there was war in heaven. Michael and his angels fought against the dragon, and the dragon fought with his angels, but did not win, and their place is no longer in heaven. And that great dragon, that ancient serpent called the devil and Satan, who deceived the whole world, was cast out. He was cast out to the earth, and his angels were cast out with him. These fallen angels are described as evil forces that influence and deceive mankind at the end of time. They are said to join the Antichrist and the false prophet to fight against God's followers. Drying up of the Euphrates River In Revelation chapter 16 verse 12, the drying up of the Euphrates River is prophesied as part of the apocalyptic events leading to the Battle of Armageddon. The verse reads, The sixth angel poured his cup over the great river Euphrates, and the water was dried up, so that the way for the kings of the east might be prepared. The drying up of the Euphrates River is a symbolic event that has major implications. This is believed to open the way for the kings of the East and potentially allow the forces of evil to gather for the final battle at Armageddon. The drying up of the Euphrates River is often interpreted as a supernatural event, emphasizing the enormity of the end-time events described in the book of Revelation. It is seen as a sign of the culmination of God's divine plan and the final battle between good and evil.